Hey guys, Nebris here, and well, at some point my Minecraft crashed and I brought it back up and didn't do a microphone test on it. And so, yeah, we lost all the audio on that stuff, so yep, we're in a cave. We've, done, we've already done a crap ton of caving. Um, yeah, so yeah, you guys missed a lot. <laughs> But you know what, we're not done yet. I still have a little bit of efficiency pick left. So we're going to exhaust that and then call it a day. Um, so what shall we do? Oh gosh, another evil Skeletor. Oh, lots of people are on right now, including a new guy, Generic B. He is um, a new addition to our server. Very happy to have him on. Um, don't know him too well, but you know... He's a friend of uh, Paws and Milby, I believe. So, um, you know, can't be too bad a guy. <laughs> Good, let him on. Apparently, there's a reason for that. So, trust Jude's. I trust Kud's judgment. Some guy named Jude's on the server. Ooh, more gold. Actually, I actually have an uncle named Jude. Cool story, bro. And yes, he was named after the song. There's a song? Uh, I, I really hope people know that there's a song. I'm not even going to go into that. So, I said a bunch of things, and I don't remember what it was I said, so I'm just going to not say any of that again. Because, God forbid, you hear it twice. Um, hmm, what do I have to talk about? Because <laughs> I already said it all. Um, oh God, that's not good. Let's get out of here. So, yeah, um, I guess let's talk about some future plans I have for my base, because things have changed significantly in the last update. Um, for starters, I think the biggest thing is villager trading. I actually do need to finish my uh, village underground, and I don't know how I'm going to do that quite yet, because it's, it's hard to make a village underground, because it doesn't identify houses without daylight shining on it. So, I have to keep that in mind when building the infrastructure around it. Additionally, I've noticed skeletons have just been standing absolutely still, lying in wait, while a zombie sneaks up on you from behind. They're... I don't know what's happened to them, but they, they've gotten pretty dumb. Well, never mind. Not entirely dumb. Diamond! I don't have enough of that. Um, how do I want to do this? It looks to be hanging over lava, which is just what I need. So yeah, I gotta make a village. I'm actually very interested in going back to spawn and actually, you know, finishing my base there. Because, I mean, other people are doing it. <laughs> Everyone's doing it. Oh, there's just a single piece of diamond. So every everyone is doing not everyone's doing it. People are doing it and I don't want to be left out. I never really did I was never really satisfied with the base I had there. So I feel that I should really, you know, go back and finish that. Make it look pretty. Up to my standards of awesome buildiness. So I'm going to do that. Additionally, I can now finish the Ender Ender. I'm going to decorate it as I have always intended to decorate it. I don't know how useful it's going to be um, these days. I guess it'll still be good if you just want to hammer out like a bunch of max enchants. Because enchanting has changed rather significantly in the last patch. I'm very happy with what we have as a change. I mean, it's not perfect, but you know what? It's something that really needed to be addressed, and I think that I'm happy that they at least addressed it. Which is, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm grateful, I swear. Uh, darn it. Um, okay, I guess I'm going to head up here. It's not where I want to be, but there's a Skeletor down there. The gyms is squealing like a little girl. I'm wondering why. 
Ooh. Oh yeah, you can make ice now. So that's a thing. You can gather ice. Maybe I need to incorporate that into a build somewhere. We'll have to see about that, because you know what? Ice is pretty darn cool. Yes, I would definitely advise against licking it. Get out of the way. So I think you really have to be on the same level as these mobs in order for them to uh, recognize your presence. And I don't expect that to be a glitch that's around for too long, but hopefully it'll be around for the um, next time we do Ultra Hardcore. Or at least the next time I do Ultra Hardcore. <laughs> what does that mean? I don't know. Maybe I'm just saying stuff. Okay, so, I only have space for one more thing. I'm pretty cont I'm pretty set on keeping all this stuff. I might get rid of that six moss stone if I don't find a, another dungeon to justify the space that is consuming. Oh, I just did something. Alrighty, that takes care of that. That takes care of it even more. Oh, here's some darkness. And the thing is, I'm in an, in an extreme hills biome. Okay, so yeah, if that happens in Ultra Hardcore, I mean, before I would just be taking hits from that, but now they're just standing still. They're, if you're off by two, it seems that they're going to ignore you. Oh, and there's also an animation for a fully charged critical, which you just saw there briefly. Of a... Uh, not a critical, but a fully charged bow attack, bow strike. Bow strike, that sounds so much cooler than it actually is. Okay, where are the baddies at? So yeah, if you are above or below them entirely, I don't think they're gonna notice you. And, um, I don't know, that, it's a glitch, and I hope they get rid of it. Oh, this guy seemed to notice me just fine. Whew. Oh, I hear you, Skeletor. I think I just saw iron there. I can't really tell. You guys can look back. The skeletons are a bit less evil right now. I'm really happy about that. Finally, I've exhausted this bread that was taking up an... Inventory spot. Oh boy. Okay, down here. Is this gonna even go anywhere? No. Where's the skeleton I hear, though? It's probably up there. Um, <clears throat> so... Yesterday... Was, um... My one friend's birthday. So we all came over to my place and we watched Aladdin to celebrate because that's just how us cool people celebrate things, is watching Disney movies and singing along to it. And yeah, I had a blast. So we got this ice cream cake because she's like obsessed with ice cream. It's pretty unhealthy. And you know what? I <laughs> So we got an ice cream cake that was, um, it was the, oh, what the heck, submarine? It was, um, the Girl Scout Thin Mints as an ice cream cake. Yeah, it was twice as delicious as it sounds. So definitely try that if you ever want to, like, gain 50 pounds. <laughs> ah, so yeah, um, I actually, I finally got to meet, um, uh, the girl's sister who I've been, you know, Ooh, diamond. Like, I've, I've been... <laughs> she always describes her sister, like, very highly. Um, and so I've taken to harassing her about her sister. Uh, and I finally met her, and... Oh, stupid skeletons. Oh my gosh, skeletons. And yeah, um... I don't know where I'm going with this. I finally met the sister, who I've only heard of before actually meeting her. And... yeah. 
Wow, at the skeletons. Do I have, like, every other place in this area lit up? That must be it. Whew. Okay, how do I get out of here? <laughs> Don't want to be wasting my pick, because that's going to be the limiting factor here. Once I lose that pick, I mean, there's not much else I can do. Oh yeah, I forgot about this diamond. I hope it's a big grouping. Uh, I'm happy. Three, four, five, six. Can't go wrong with six diamond. So how many do I have now? I have 72. 72. That's going to be pretty darn awesome. Once I uh, collect them all. So yeah, um, we totally watched Aladdin. I have all the Aladdin songs stuck in my head because that movie is awesome. It's not my favorite Disney movie, though. That would probably be The Lion King. And my favorite Disney song is definitely the Mulan one. So yeah, huge Disney nerd. <laughs> what? Where is this? How did I not explore this area fully? Hmm. Is there anything to that? Yes, but it's going in the wrong direction. I want to be going down. And I'm in the plains biome, which explains why I haven't seen any of this green stuff. Oh my god, look how much he has. Can't wait to fortune it. So let's head over this direction, which is probably in the direction of those planes, but you know, at this point I'm so disoriented that I just don't know anymore. I really like the wide open areas in the cave. I looked at him. Whew, that was close. Um, you know what? Let's kill him. Take his eye. Because I'm cruel like that. Um, I'm considering making one of those ender chests, which is new. The ender chest allows you to basically have a, another few inventory spaces. Oh, hello! Like a boss. Ow. <laughs> wow, did I eat those words quickly. <laughs> Alright, what do we got? Some pop sick. Bucket. Nothing worthwhile except for the um mossy cobble. Um <clears throat> What else did I do Thursday? Oh, we watched the um the Batman movie with um Jack Nicholson, that one, the old Joker. And here's a fun fact that I just realized. Um there was actually a Harvey Dent character in that movie, and, uh, I mean, it's been almost a decade since I've seen it, and he's played by Lando. Yes, the same actor, whoever his real name is, that played Lando in Star Wars Empire Strikes Back is also Harvey Dent. So, yeah, that was pretty cool. And there was a police officer whose name was Eckhart, which is the name of the actor who actually played Harvey Dent in the new one. Oh, no, I have leftovers. No. You know what? Screw it. I have enough of that stuff. I'll live. This gold, on the other hand, can't have enough of that. I'm thinking about making a room where I place all my, like, rare item blocks. So, like, the gold blocks, the, um, lupus blocks, the emerald blocks, and the, um, diamond blocks. I think I want to have a room where I just place them and just stare at how rich I am. Um, additionally, there's something else I was planning, and I can't remember what it is. I mean, I've been contemplating doing a single-player world, um... That's hardcore, and you know what? I think I'm going to do that. It's, it's probably mostly going to be a live stream thing, though. Um, but, you know, I might make a video or two of it. Um, 
Also, I should really be making those live stream videos into, um, put it, putting them up on YouTube would be a good idea. You know, just for the people who miss the live stream and don't know to go to Twitch TV slash Nebris, or twitchtv.com slash Nebris, I don't know, the former one might resolve. But, yeah, um, I try to do regular live streams. It hasn't been the case recently, but with my, um, having better things to do. <laughs> like Aladdin parties. <laughs> Aladdin-themed birthday parties. And come on, who wouldn't want one of those? <sighs> um, let's see. Oh, dear. Nope, nothing to that. Ultra Hardcore. Um, I've discontinued that series because we made a decision to only do Ultra Hardcore stuff as a group, and Good was talking like that had that decision had been like made, and I was ignoring it. But I guess he didn't seem to understand that I had never heard of this decision. <laughs> Um, cause I, that's not something I would ignore. So, that got cleared up, and I've discontinued that, uh, Ultra Hardcore live stream. I've even deleted the world. It was a very nice world, too. I, I got pretty darn far. Oh, and I maxed out on the gunpowder as well. Sweet. Um... Yeah, that's about it. Uh, I'm definitely really reinvigorated, ready to play more Minecraft. Whereas before, I was just so burnt out. And I'm, I'm really glad I took that break because, I mean, my video, my attempts at making video were very poor, to say the least. And, I mean, I don't want to give you guys less than ideal quality material here we go this is this is where I want to be um maybe not okay that looks promising so let's make this stuff okay and thought it was promising that didn't happen Oh, um, I don't know if I've said this already, but I think it's worth saying again if I... just to make sure that it gets, um, heard by you guys. There has been interest on Reddit in a Civilization V play, let's play of sorts, with the Minecrackers. Um, <clears throat> oh god. They've gotten stronger. Um, and... I've reached out to a few people. I think Packrat would be interested. Um, I am certainly interested. But the thing is, we don't know the kind of quality of videos we could put out on that subject because Civ 5 isn't exactly a, a good game for Let's Play. It's pretty darn slow. And when it isn't slow, it's, like, very difficult to understand what's going on. Unless you... unless you're familiar with the game itself already. Um... It's a great game. Oh, I missed that jump. I'm gonna have... To, I have to make it again. Okay, well, it was this guy. Whew. Almost overshot it. You know what? I think I'm done with this area. I think I've found everything there is to find. Except for this little skeleton death hole. It's... it's gone. My pick is gone. I hate this guy. I hate this guy so much right now. Well, that is it for this caving adventure of ours. Let's put this back. We don't want this. <laughs> Um, so yeah, uh, Civilization V Let's Play, perhaps? Unlikely, but you know what? It might happen. So, yeah, thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you guys like that I'm back. <laughs>
Um, Sombert. I'm not ready to go, though. I'm still super psyched about being back. Um, oh, I need... I am going to ask you guys for an, a good adventure map recommendation that I could make a series out of. So if you know of any good ones, please, by all means, share one with me, and maybe I'll do it. Um, so yeah, that's going to be it for today. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys next time.